What's up guys and welcome back to another episode of Ghost Recon Wildlands. Today we have a very exciting side mission to take on. Antonio's wife Gabrielle is in trouble with the cartel. Uni dad headed if this way. Her, she might be able to help fill in some of the gaps in our knowledge Buckle about up, the cartel. Buckle up people. All right, here we go. So, if you guys remember our last episode, we wanted to take down the Bucon of this province. His name was Antonio. He was basically the uh, the runner. He was the one that facilitated all the movement of the cocaine in the area. And to be able to get to him, we used his wife. It just so happens that his wife is smoking hot. And now Sueño and the rest of the gang know that she's the one that gave him the intel, or gave us the intel on his whereabouts. And so, uh, obviously she's in trouble, and, uh... We're moving. Stay behind me. Like any superhero, we're gonna be saving the damsel in distress. Let's go ahead and, let's take the charger here. I'm gonna hop in this thing. Let's go, girl. Woohoo! She is sexy. Alright, sorry boys. Only room for one in the car. Looks like we're engaged, and they are after us, but... Should be able to get the heck out of here. I knew I never should have told you anything. They're going to bore me alive because of you. No one's gonna hurt you. I promise. It wasn't always like this. When I first met Antonio, he was a sweetheart. He used to write me letters. No one write letters anymore. But he did. I made fun of him for it. It doesn't seem so funny now. Drug money changes people. This life changes people. The only way to survive is to have eyes in the back of your head. Eventually, you stop looking forward. You've got another chance. You can start a new life. I can change where I live. I can change how I look. I can even change my name. It will never be a new life. Yeah, it'd be hard to get away from what you've seen, the experiences you've had so far, but it's all right, girl. We're just, uh, I mean, we'll, we'll take a couple pallets that we found yesterday. We're gonna head off. Charter a little jet and uh, the world will never see us again. <laughs> oh man, she's uh, she's pretty hot. I would consider it. I wouldn't really. Chelsea, I love you. Hopefully you're not watching this video. But she is hot. I think Chelsea would agree. She's got that like Colombian accent. Whoa, I got eyes on a big fucking house. Welcome to Shea Beauty Queen. You should drop in and say hello. Bowman says she's in Peru at the moment. Business trip. But a little recon couldn't hurt. All right, we made it. She's out, and she's gonna be safe. You're never gonna see Antonio again, ever. He's on his way to a prison in the United States, where he will spend the rest of his life. For the next seventy years, he will stare at the same walls, he will piss in the same toilet, and he'll have the same conversation with himself until his brain finally breaks life is over for him god that sounds awful you on the other hand have choices if you want you can leave right now of course we both know they will kill you before you even cross the street what if I don't know anything Look both ways before you cross the street. <laughs> Man, all right. So, like I said, this province is already taken over. You guys can see we've already completed it. It's already marked off. We don't even have to do that mission, but I just I thought it'd be be kind of fun to do that one. Anyway, let's see what should we do next. I was kind of thinking. There's one more four-star difficulty, which is up here in Espiritu Santo. So I think we're gonna go do that one. Let's fast travel to this safe house, hop in a vehicle, head on over there, and I'll see you guys once we get there. Whoa, check out this bridge, dude. Oh my gosh, this is actually kind of cool. You fit two cars on here? Just barely, this is awesome little bridge through the treetops of the jungle. Anyway, guys, we are making our way to our next province here. It's a little bit sketchy. Up here in the woods, not really a lot of visibility. Not really a lot of people. Hopefully Bowman calls in and gives us some uh, idea of where we're supposed to be going. Whoa! 
Okay, that was almost really bad. That could have been so much worse. We're entering a province called we survived. Espiritu Santo. Espiritu Santo is the base for Sueño's religious propaganda. Key to that is a woman named La Santera, a self-proclaimed Santa Muerta priestess with thousands of loyal followers. That witch has an uncanny ability to turn men with guns into fanatics. That's the shit that keeps me up at night. Narcos have been into Santa Muerte for decades, but most worshippers aren't cartel. That's a small mercy. You got an angle on changing the mind of a fanatic? You're gonna need to dig for intel. Find out how to take down La Santera in a way that will demoralize the Sicarios and turn the regular folk away from the cartel. When she loses her congregation, bring that witch to me. Bowman out. La Santera, the Saint Maker. Es una chica loca. This chick is batshit crazy. <laughs> she used to be a good girl, devout Catholic, until she found Santa Muerte, the skinny lady, and went all in. If El Cardinal is the light, charitable side of Santa Muerte, La Santera is the dark hedonism. The cartel's twisted, fucked up version of the saint. El Sueño knows a chart topper when he sees one, so he put her on his label. Preach, mommy. What's good for Santa Muerte is good for Santa Blanca. He even built her a sanctuary deep in the heart of Espiritu Santo. La Santera's role in the cartel? Ensure loyalty. The more cartel members prove themselves, the more access they get to Santa Muerte. You want Santa Muerte to protect you from bullets? Smuggle 200 kilos. You want to be blessed with eternal wealth? Recruit five of your cousins to Santa Blanca. You want to go to heaven? Kill ten of her enemies. It's like a ranking system for scumbags. The more you do for your cartel, the more the saint of holy death will do for you. A true reward for true believers. And trust me on this. La Santera is a true believer. This is gonna be freaky. And it looks like... This area with all the enemies that we just passed... I see a second target. It's gonna be our first mission. The drone is airborne. Target one. up and tag Keep everybody back can. I got another. That's five. Holy cow. Well, this is gonna be pretty intense. Gotta take these guys out one at a time before they realize Anybody's down. Getting a position. I need to get to a better position. I got it. Moving to position. Target marked. All right. Target acquired. That actually went Stay pretty well. Weapons free. Weapons free. Got it. Nice. We're good. We're good. Problem solved. There's a cartel commendation here. Take this. Metal has a coca plant on it. Three That's skill points. Cool. We get over these. Climb it. Nope. Okay. Go around the outside then. <laughs> okay, so there's a cache in this this gold mine. Shit! Both of those guys do what? Clear over here. They're doing some sort of demonistic, sadistic type baloney down here, and I just I I don't like it. Okay, we're gonna switch over to C4. Primed. Throw that down in there. We're gonna get the heck out of here. Escape it before it collapses. Be Let's take off before we get buried alive. Go. Alrighty, Al. So this must be one of their like their shrines that they worship in. We'll watch it collapse. Nice. What's mission status in the Spiritu Santo? Sapper Daddy got busy. We just blew up a cartel gold cache. Holt's heart is broken forever. Well, you better get over it fast. The activity has intercepted the call. Santa Blanc is moving their remaining gold cache to safety. We gotta hit that cache before they do. We're on it. All right. So it looks like we are gonna have a, uh, a second section of the mission here, which is all the way up here in the northern part. La Santera's cult is financed with gold provided by El Sueño. Locate and destroy these gold caches, and let's see if we can shake El Sueño's faith in the cult. Okay. 
Well, that sounds good to me, but uh, we have a long ways to go, four kilometers, and we have no helicopter to get there. I don't know how many helicopters we're going to find in this area either. And we don't even have the map unlocked, so we're not even sure which way we're supposed to be going. Oh, actually, I do see a helicopter, and it's right next to some intel, so this is perfect. This couldn't be better. Nice little village on the side of town here. We're gonna grab this intel, we're gonna swoop the helicopter, and we're gonna get the heck out of here. What the heck? My door just shut from like, I think it's like the vacuum of air. Barracks in the jungle. Looks like Las Enteras detail of Sicarios is living there. And honestly, it kind of scared me. Background. Just spotted one with submachine guns. All right. Sure are a lot of lights and switches up here. Turn the spotlight off, don't want to see them. Don't want them to see us taking off. Here we go, fellas. We're we'll gonna be heading north to the next gold cache. I'll see you guys there. Actually, just kidding. We're turning this thing on around because we see uh, another main mission here along the way that we might as well. I mean, if we're already right next to it, there's no reason not to, right? So we're gonna go ahead and land this thing. We're gonna take all these guys out. Kinda reminds me of the Valle de los Caídos in Spain. You know that Civil War monument? I gotta hand it to Sueño. He's got some impressive architects and engineers on his payroll. Target acquired. Standing by. So we're gonna take down all these Sicarios in here. Those boys look kinda salty. I expect Los Enteras personal Sicarios are some of Santa Blanca's best. There's a whole lot of them. Who's feeling froggy? This should be I fun. Let's go on the pilgrimage route. They built these places to house pilgrims from the U.S., Mexico, and Central America. Hold up. I'm seeing a lot of cartel activity over here. Maybe some kind of barracks. In this area, they probably answer directly to La Santera. Roger. Target acquired. Got the target. Good to go. Nice. That almost got bad right there. They almost lost their target right at the wrong time. Bowman, you just traded nice. gunshots with a bunch of thick-skinned Sicarios here in Espiritu Santo. Don't let your weapons cool down. I'm uploading coordinates for another Santa Blanca camp nearby. Shoot! All right, I guess we could do that. There's another Santa Blanca camp. Where? Where would that be? Is that down here? No. Where's the other camp? Ah, oh, it's over here to the right. That's okay. We'll go finish that. Or right, you know what? Let's let's just stick on it because we're. Well, Terra keeps her people in line with a personal force of Sicario bodyguards. Take them out, and we make her look weak in front of El Sueño and her followers. I'm excited to go blow up this second gold mine, so I, I want to go do that, but we already started another side mission, so let's, Man, let's do this one first, it's kind of on the way, that one time. and then uh, blow up the second mine. say only three guys but no there are quite a few more than three still gonna be pretty easy though I'm not too worried about it the first one was no issue pick off the stragglers to start things off almost messed that up entirely but we're okay I got a narco over here next to the building I'm spotting another tango civilians in the area watch your targets I don't know how we're gonna manage this. Marking target. Watch the background. Bad guys are marked. Waiting on you, boss. I've got the target. Say the word, boss. 
kill control engaging. Shit, he knows he's taking fire. The lieutenant's escaping. That was way too close. Oh my goodness, dude. That guy up top, I thought we hit him with a headshot. We didn't hit the head. So we just did one one shot to the like shoulder and oh. That could have got bad right there. They could have sent in reinforcements and all kinds of stuff. Target's marked. Good to go. Copy target target three. ready to engage. Got him. Taking a shot. Got it. That's it. Fought to the last man. All right. Surrender isn't in their vocabulary. I'll take it. Mission complete. One step close to clearing up this province, so that was a nice little side mission, but now it's time to get back to the main one we were working on when we first came into this province. We're going to be heading up to this gold mine. cult is financed with gold provided by El Sueño. Locate and destroy these gold caches, and let's see if we can shake El Sueño's faith in the cult. All right. 1.5 kilometers. It's not too far away. We are, guys. The Northern Gold Cache. Gonna find out where it is. Oh, I see it over there. A little hole in the wall. Try to land the chopper on the slope. Uh, I think we'll be okay. Stay, buddy. Oh! I forgot the parking brake. Hold on. I wish there was a way to shut it off without getting out of it. Oh no. Oh, it's going down. I'm yelling, Timber! No, I think we might just slide to a stop here. I think we're okay. All right, we're, we're, we'll see what happens I afterwards. Let's just focus on the mission. I got a Sicario with a minigun near that sandbag emplacement. So that is definitely the area we want to be going to. Deploying drone. Got another tango. You guys got him? Acquired. I've got the target. Enemy All right. Down. Now I gotta be careful in here. I didn't expect people to be inside the shaft last time and they were, so. Never really know what to expect. It looks like we have a lot of enemies in here too. Look at all that gold. Okay. It says we're engaged, but I don't know if we actually are. I got the C4 primed. Demo is primed and in place. I'm gonna get some more ammo. We're gonna get the heck out of here. Fuck, they're coming right at us. Here we got the C4 down. So I guess he radioed in right as he was about to die. Which is not good, but... There it is. Holy shit, the whole place is about to collapse. Let's get the hell out of here, now. Dude, we're killing it. The C4 is so smart, it makes it so easy. We're gonna be out of here on our chopper. By the time that thing collapses. Where is the ch I don't even see the chopper anymore. Was it over here to the left? I don't even need to, oh, there it is, it's down here. Like, we were already well outside. And there it goes. All gold cash is destroyed. Mission we're complete. Up. Holy nice. shit. You can say that again. And with that, today we have destroyed a couple gold caches, taken out a couple enemy encampments, 
saved super hot wife and we're halfway through completing this province. So I'm going to call that a mission well done, a job well done. I'm going to see you guys in our next episode. Peace out.